Hi folks, Richard the Dick Coughlin here, Dick Dynasty 666, how are you? Uh, this video, I thought I'd be doing something that I have, I've only ever done once before, and it was about five years ago. I did a video about five years ago where I just did impressions of other YouTubers, and I thought maybe I'll bring one back and do another one just for a laugh. So, uh, if you haven't heard of any of the people who I'm doing impressions with in this video, then it's going to be pretty fucking shit. But I'll leave links to all the channels that I am parodying today. I'll leave that link, the links down below. I recommend you subscribe to at least some of them. Hello everybody, my name is Marty. I'm from Norway. And today I'll be looking at a video called Spirit Science. It's made by some guy called Jordan. And Jordan seems to have some very peculiar ideas about the world as it works. And he creates Spirit Science. It seems to make him extremely happy and he's very positive and upbeat. And so I decided I must crush all his delusions in front of him and leave him a big depressed mess on the floor. Because that is what skepticism is all about. So let's listen to Jordan here. Hello, I'm Jordan. I'm spirit science. It's bloody amazing. It's the universe, right? It's all made, it's made out of chocolate. And, and three million years ago, I, I, some, a big rhinoceros flew out of the sky, flew out of nowhere, and just a big, big, did a great big poo, and a big poo, and a thing, and a thing came flying out of its bottom. And, and, and all these, and all these martians came flying around, all wearing tutus, going, and then all ran around, and then did a bit, and then I ran out to have a lie down for five minutes, and then a giant thing, and then Atlantis came over, and then, then there's a big, big banana, big banana came over, and it went, blah, 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 and the banana came out, it was amazing. And it all turned and then I, and then I travelled and then all the drugs wore off and I ended up in hospital. Uh, it was amazing. And that's not even the stupid part. Jordan, Jews do not come from space. Hi guys, it's me, Francis. As you can probably tell by looking at me, I I I've lost a lot of weight since the last video. And 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 but thank you for, for not bothering to call me and see if I was okay. And you can also see that I've grown a massive beard. And I didn't grow a beard, I just lost so much weight that it turned out I, I had this beard under my neck fat. And so my supreme neck beardedness seems to be a lot more than I thought it would be. People would say to me, how do you lose all that weight? Well, it's like I had a tapeworm and they, they took it out and it was like, it was this big tapeworm, it was about 50 foot long, weighed about, made about 600 pounds and they took it out and people would say, Francis, Francis, what did you eat? What did you eat to make you, what did you eat that could have a tapeworm like that in it? And I, the truth is I just ate the tapeworm and now I'm only 118 pounds, so fuck you freely, banana girl! Yeah, so bye. Hey, Vsauce, Michael here. So, people always ask me, say, Michael, why, when you make your videos, do you always come up from the bottom of the screen and up top? Well, you see, going from down here to up here is the quickest way for me to get to the camera and not make sure I lose any of the buzz from the blow I've done. <sighs> and as always, thanks for watching. Hello everybody, welcome to my laboratory where safety is number one priority. <laughs> now today we're going to be showing you that you uh, this is a can of coke. You probably recognize can of coke, yeah? It, it tastes good, yeah, it's great, yeah? And, uh, but you probably when you get your coke, you probably, you, you'll probably be opening it using the ring pull, the ring pull here. You just pull on it and you open the the can like that, and it can, it takes, see that took ages, it took very long to do that, and I'm gonna show you probably, you've been doing this wrong, like this is the more effective way to get the can open. Yeah. Have a good day! Hey, LA Beast here! Today, I'm gonna be doing a brand new challenge on YouTube, but barely anyone else has tried yet. In fact, I'm the first. And it's simply called the Potato Chip Challenge. It's very simple. All you have to do is eat one potato chip and swallow it. Whoever does it the fastest wins. But I should warn you in advance as well, LAB style, I have attached a bear trap 
to my testicles so that if I so much as flinch whilst ingesting this potato chip, I'm going to have my balls sawn off. So without further ado, I am the L.A. Beast and this is the Potato Chip Challenge. <sighs> Oh god! Oh! 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 Oh god! Oh god! Oh, this is bad. Oh, I gotta go to the hospital. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! That was a stupid idea. What's up everybody, it's Critical, I'm playing How Big Is Your Wiener on the PC. Basically the way this game works is uh, they're gonna flash up a picture of some random random dude. I've gotta guess how big his wiener is, I gotta draw it here on the screen. So uh, I've familiarized myself with men's wieners and so let's do this shit. First one. Oh man, check out this guy. Yeah, just turn around, look him in the face and start rubbing your nipples at him. Get those bad boys lactating a little bit. Well, let's have a look here. Well, it's uh, I, he's an old, he's old, but you know, he's gonna, he's gonna have sack because look at his age. So I don't think there's gonna be much in the way of actual, actual schlong here, but uh, we'll probably have a little bit. We're gonna have big slangy hanging balls here. Big hanging balls. Big hanging balls down here. And, um, yeah, I think that's gonna be it. Um, I'll just give him a little bit there. Probably just a drip, one drip, that's it, of, uh, something. I've done some stupid shit in my life, like directing barnyard pornography and shaving my asshole, but this has gotta be one of the dumbest, so. And, uh, yeah, next! Well, now, don't, I know you can't see me, but don't think for one second that I'm not naked. I'm approximately three seconds away from wreaking havoc on my undergarments. Now this guy looks a little bit insecure, like he's got issues, you know. But I don't think it affects him too bad. I think he's probably he's probably on the balls, probably just pretty pretty standard there. Uh, probably just the one. Let's see if I can do his. Uh, oh, he's got some hair coming out from from the balls there, and uh, probably just one. One long thin, that's all it is. That, that's just his long there. And uh, he's gonna, uh, fuck, I'll put his other testicle, but his other testicle's up here. So, yeah, I think that's, uh, that's probably what his one looks like. All right, yeah, come on. And the last one here, let's check out the last one. All right, oh god damn. In the words of William Shakespeare, Mrs. Rockwell, must I compare thee to a summer's day? Shit, you're asshole now check it out testosterone levels rising checking for boner erection confirmed i don't know if i've got a guff goddamn room here to put this one in let's put it right there and uh i reckon this one's pretty angular it looks just like just rams this shit in there are several million people in the world several billion people but nobody has a scrotum as itchy as i've got now but i reckon this I reckon this guy here, he's got a load, and then it's gonna be like that, yeah. And I think that's pretty much it. So check that one. I'm about done playing this, so like this video, favorite, comment, and uh, subscribe if you want to see videos similar to this one. See ya. I can't do any impression. I can't do any impression of it. Need to have a lobotomy. In. I've watched more than a. I'll, I'll give it a go. Um, I'm pretty! Yeah, that'll do. Sums it all up. <clears throat> That's it, folks. I hope you enjoyed that video. Below is a link to my uh, entry to the British Comedy Awards. Um, don't forget you can click on that and vote now. You just have to click on the link and press vote. You don't have to sign up for anything. Also below are link to the show I'm doing in October. I'm doing a live show. Tickets available for that. And my Patreon and yada 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 everything else. Other than that, this has been Richard the Dick Coughlin. Good night. May God be less.